So apparently, Machine Gun Kelly has decided to cover System of a Down's classic aerials at the Howard Stern show. Now, I know that I will never talk about Machine Gun Kelly on this channel. And yet alone, I know, or well, we know, I should say, that he's been getting a lot of flack, especially talking about these guys as weird for their masks and now releasing his new album, Mainstream Sellout. But this is, for me, something unexpected but to turn for the worst. And don't get me thinking about Puddle of Mud's cover of About a Girl. Please don't. But this is something I would say may be remotely insulting to hear this. And uh, with System of a Down being one of my favourite bands of all time, I really, really don't know how this is going to turn out. I bet it's just going to be blatantly obvious. Let's just dive right into this. <laughs> So, acoustically is pretty nice. The beginning sounds as accurate, like what System of a Down does. I wonder what the vocals are going to be. I totally respect the rest of the musicians, but... Machine Gun Kelly's vocals on this just sound stale, and it's lackluster. Serge Tankian's range brings it so much strength, especially the harmonies, and the guitarist distortion is panned in the background, then giving it all its worth, like what System does. Oh my god, what the heck is this? When he hits lower registers, it does not sound good. It's flat out of its its own merit of trying to make it as profound as the original. And with this whole acoustic renditions of metal songs, sometimes it works, sometimes it does not work. And like I said, I do give it to the rest of the guys for putting in more effort. But these vocals sound tired. They sound not warmed up. You sound so bad. It's totally off key. How can you mess this up? And that's not how you do it. The vocals on the aggression part is raised higher. He follows the same notes on the guitar, but in the wrong register. And this is brutal, but in such a catastrophe of wasting an opportunity to dominate as much as the original. Gosh, mad rough. This is very mad. This is madly rough. And I don't have any issue with anybody who would play alongside a soon-to-be continuing pop-punk artist, former rap artist, 
into this new direction. But this cover is really, really bad. Really bad that it's bland upon one of the stylist, emotionless, and weakest attempts for putting out any quality of music that's been covered many times and I don't care what anyone says and as much as I am never a fan of Machine Gun Kelly I wanted to give this cover some credit but I can't get along with these these disgusting sounds from the vocals. So that's all I would like to say for this. I've heard worse, but at least with Wes Scatlin from his monotonous rendition of About a Girl, the musicians here get a pass. But for Machine Gun Kelly, he was just bored out of his own misery smoking a puff, smoking a joint, and, you know, his voice is just as hoarse. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll keep you guys posted for more videos in the near future.